Good Sunday, everyone. It's a weather aware day on the Cumberland Plateau as we have showers and thunderstorms that'll be threatening our area this afternoon and evening and into the early overnight hours. Some of those storms could be strong to severe, as you can see here on our daily weather map, a large threat area stretching from eastern Texas all the way into, Oak, into Kentucky and Tennessee, much of the deep south. I'll talk more about that in just a moment. Elsewhere across the country, strong to severe thunderstorms also threaten portions of the Oklahoma-Texas panhandle, stretching up into eastern Colorado. And elsewhere, just showers and thunderstorms as a very unsettled pattern has settled in. Look at our five-day forecast, 50% chance for showers and thunderstorms today. If any storm forms this afternoon, let's be very weather aware for those. Those can really pack a punch when they're kind of all by themselves. Now tonight, 100% chance for showers and thunderstorms as a line of storms pushes through. And that line will contain the, poten the potential for damaging straight line winds, some hail, some heavy rainfall. Um, so we'll be mindful of that. Monday, just a 30% chance for morning showers. The rest of the day is looking good. The forecast has trended drier um, for much of the rest of the week. It now looks like this front that we thought could bring us some very beneficial rainfall by the middle to end of next week is going to kind of wash out. So the severe threat has really amped up for this evening and tonight. Um, while the rain threat for the middle to end of next week has really gone down. So the storm system is packing more of a punch today, but that means we get less rain chances the middle to end of next week as it looks right now. So 20% chance on Tuesday, 20% chance now on Wednesday, and then 30% on Thursday. Even rainfall amounts from today's system have, have dropped because of the line of storms that'll just kind of move through pretty quick and that'll be gone. So our rainfall deficit is not looking to improve a great deal this week. It will improve a little bit, but not as much as we had hoped. This is the Storm Prediction Center outlook for today. This is a bit of a surprising upgrade to enhance. I mean, we were marginal yesterday. That's, that's the level one threat out of five. Now we're level three out of five. Um, and I'm not sure that the strongest storms will threaten our area, but we'll just be mindful and uh, know that that potential is there. And so we'll be uh, weather aware, that is for sure. But as you can see, the threat area is quite large. And then this is my thoughts. Um, flash flood risk is low. Our ground is dry. We can take a lot of rainfall and we're not going to get that much to deal with anyway. It doesn't look like, um, you know, depends on how much rain that, that squall line produces. Straight line winds, I have increased that threat just a bit, but I'm not quite ready to go to medium. Um, hail threat is still low and tornado threat, I did increase that just a bit. Wind shear is a little elevated when that line comes through. And even and if any isolated storm can develop this afternoon, that would pose a tornado risk. It's just questionable about whether or not those isolated storms will even develop. Um, and if they do, how severe those will be. But it depends on how much sunshine we get today too. You know that drill. Um, if you get a lot of sunshine, it heats things up, makes things unstable. And so we have a better chance for severe thunderstorms. If we say cloudy and kind of cool today and rainy off and on, then our severe threat would be much lower. So if you have outdoor plans today, please pay attention to the weather. Uh, watch that radar. Um, if you're camping out tonight, um, definitely check the radar and uh, and i would i would advise postponing that because you don't want to be out there on a squall line coming through that would just ruin your entire camping trip so uh so stuff like that be very mindful of um other than that um, i'll keep a very 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 close eye on things and um and i'll keep you posted i'll probably post some updates this afternoon to let you know how things are evolving and i'm um, seeing if our threat is increasing or decreasing so um, i'll be right here watching it all and keeping you posted at meteorologistmark.com